Hi, and welcome to jaredbodine.com. Today we'll be looking at the new third generation Nest Learning Thermostat, and we'll also see how that compares to the second generation thermostat. Noticeably, of course, is the larger screen size, which isn't significant if you're up close. The new larger screen is equivalent to a 480 by 480 display. It's hard to use square references for a small round display, so it's more relevant to say that it packs 229 pixels per inch, which is very respectable for even smartphones, let alone a stationary thermostat. They both use the same app, which is available free from the Apple App Store as well as Google Play. The motion detector is called Farsight, and it works noticeably better in my home. Not only will that let you see the temperature settings more conveniently, but it will also make auto away more accurate. Because there's plenty of the second generation still available, you can get them now for $199 compared to the $249 price of the third generation. If you don't care about having a larger screen or a motion sensor that detects you further across the room, then you might be able to save some money on getting the second generation because the basic functionality of the two is really gonna be the same and the user interface on the apps also the same. The last significant upgrade is the addition of a five gigahertz ABGN wireless. Since you won't be using this for media viewing, I doubt the extra bandwidth will really make a difference though. In another video, I'm going to be showing you how I installed the Nest, both the second and the third generations, and how I configure and utilize them. Thank you for visiting jaredbodine.com, the tech that you need to know.